This kind of shitty 2015 documentary from a born-again Christian filmmaker who decided to investigate the Guidestones. In it, the producers trick the one man who knows Robert Christian's real identity and who had promised never to reveal it into allowing them to open this case containing their correspondence on camera. And in doing so, seemingly revealed that the Guidestones were ordered by a man named, uh, a man named Dr. Herbert Kirsten. And if that documentary is right, and Kirsten is the man behind the Guidestones, that is pretty troubling because he was a doctor from Fort Dodge, Iowa with multiple interests. Conservation, certainly. Population control, absolutely. Population control, absolutely. But he also wrote at least two letters in newspapers praising David Duke. Yeah, that's David Duke, the Klan leader and neo-Nazi arguing, among other things, that Duke voices many beliefs held by reasonable Americans, it is unfortunate that more acceptable public figures are not pushing similar views. Which is the sort of thing that makes a line like guide reproduction wisely hit a little bit different now, doesn't it? And I know that you, like me, may be blindsided by this revelation, although I'm also willing to bet that others saw this coming the very moment I said, a monument in Georgia. I mean... This is a state that carved Confederate generals into the side of a mountain. It is not like white supremacist stonework is light on the ground there. Population control hit a little bit different now, doesn't it?